Part B, a graph of a uniform motion diagram. Let's say the motion from 1 to 6 is opposite the positive y direction. We'll take our note motion diagram and graph it over time. Let's say it's the motion of a coffee filter, initially at spot 1, falling to spot 6. Take that motion diagram and spread it out over time. Now by connecting the dots, or interpolating, we see we have one negative slope. What's a slope? It's a rise over a run, or displacement over time. You probably have seen before this displacement over time. It's the speed. So one negative slope means one negative speed, or one negative velocity. Simply going in what we said is the negative direction. As so we already decided, it's going opposite the positive y. Our one slope means it's uniform motion. Being that it's an arbitrary origin, we can put it anywhere we like. Let's say y of 0 is at your hand, where you drop it. Then the coffee filter falls in the negative direction from 1 to 6. But that's okay. Being at the same slope, it's still the same uniform motion. That's a lot to keep under your hat. Give him a hand.